Hey, I'm Luisa De La Vera, and this is my Toro Woman photo shoot. We had a great time on the shoot today. I mean, David's awesome. I, I feel like I'm in like an artist's den. I don't even know where, I, what time I'm in right now. It was, it was awesome. We had a really great crew of people. It was just, we just got together and had a whole bunch of fun. Comparing my style to the looks that we did today, I don't usually walk around in leather, hooker boots, and t-shirts. But uh, I would say that today's shoot, the style of it was almost like elements of myself, but totally cranked up on adrenaline. And so it was really fun to be able to play with those in a, in a totally safe, fun environment. And my own personal style is pretty chill. It's a lot of jeans and boots and v-neck shirts and blouses. Nothing too flashy, really. Right now, my go-to thing is a pair of fry boots that I actually wore on the set of Cracked for my character. And I totally fell in love with them. And they're the most comfortable, amazing pair of shoes I've ever worn. So I, I definitely snagged those when we finished shooting the first season. And those are definitely my favorite pair of or article of clothing right now. I definitely scrutinize myself when I watch, uh, so much so that I haven't even watched all the episodes that have aired up to this point. It's, it's a really stressful thing. I, I don't think I'm alone. I think a lot of people have a, a lot of actors and anyway, have a hard time watching themselves. But um, definitely try. I, I try to lose myself and try to just take in what's going on and enjoy it. I think all appealing stories just tap into some kind of basic human truth. At, at their core root, I mean, all stories just tell something about human nature that is seems so obvious, yet I think when we get caught up in our everyday lives, like this photo shoot, for example, you, you can get so uh, absorbed in details, but at the end of the day, it's say five people who've come together to work on a piece of art or, or, or something fun, and, and it's easy to kind of lose track of the easy, regular human interactions and the things that matter in life. So I, I think that any, any good story just finds what's most important. My favorite kind of story is, if you want to talk in like the overall sense, is the tortured soul who has an incredible gift and has to fight against his demons to really own it and find peace in his life or her life and to be able to give that gift to the world. And I say that just because Goodwill Hunting is one of my favorite movies and that's exactly what that is. And that's not the only one, but I think it's just such an amazing story. And it also says so much about, I think, human nature. We all want to find that gift inside of us that we're all amazing at and to fight against our own demons, to be able to own it and give it to the world. I think it's a really, really compelling, hopeful story. Three random essential things about me. I love my video games. I'm wonderful as Captain Falcon on the N64 Smash Brothers, just so everyone knows. It's a really important fact about me. I really like science and uh, the environment. And if I hadn't gone into acting, I'm sure I would have continued on the path that I was on, which was environmental science. And I'd probably be hugging a tree somewhere, saving some forest. And then the third thing uh, that people don't know about me is I'm a pretty decent cook. I'm not bad. So uh, hopefully that skill will continue to get better as time goes on as well. <laughs>